guys. So, <laughs> um, it's about quarter past six. Both the girls are awake. Um, Dan's just showering and getting ready to go. He leaves home by about half past six. Um, Maya woke up at five o'clock. She wakes up at five o'clock for her bottle. And then sometimes she goes back to sleep, sometimes she doesn't. This morning she went back to sleep till like literally two minutes ago. And Ari came walking down the passage at about six o'clock. So we're just chilling on our bed. Um, generally, I only switch the tea on uh, once Dan's left for work. Um, so that I can get changed and make breakfast for Ari. So yeah, let's get this morning going. Peggy! <laughs> for the girls. Um, Ari said she wanted cheese toast for breakfast which suits me perfectly. It's so easy. Um, we got home well yeah late for the girls last night. I only got home about half past six last night so I didn't wash any dishes last night or make Ari a school lunch so it's a little bit of a rush this morning but not too bad. Um, so yeah I'm gonna try and get all of that done and make breakfast and coffee. Definitely Doggy on your mouth already. <sighs> Are just finishing off their breakfast um but i thought i'd just show you what's in Ari's lunchbox so this is literally just her morning snack they get lunch um and then an afternoon snack at school so in here um just some dried apple and some raisins two little salty cracks a little fruit bar and a yogurt and yeah that's a little morning snack okay time to get the girls changed like so gray. hey who likes gray i like gray and yeah. who likes what who, baby? You. Yeah. Um, who so, <laughs> who likes black, my big girl? You. Yeah. So I literally just put um, Aria's clothes on her bed, and she gets changed by herself, which is super helpful. Um, and I will go get Maya changed. Bye. See you now. Um, yeah. So I'll get Maya changed quickly while Aria gets herself changed. And let's get some clothes out for Maya. We're not going anywhere fancy, so she can just get a plain little t-shirt. Hang the empty hangers up there. That's for you to play with. And let's get some shorts. Ari, you okay? Uh, I don't 
that's just good. These are actually um, sticky fudge bloomers that I got when Arrow was a baby and they're still 100%. So now let's get, oh, there's still some breakfast over there. <laughs> you funny child. Okay, let's get this child changed. Can you tell me my baby? Mom, I'm about to get ballet shoes. Come stand your feet. Your ballet shoes are just for special occasions, remember? It's so hot, you're not even going to want to wear shoes today. I want to wear shoes today. You want to wear shoes? Yeah. What about your pink sandals? No. Okay, but you're not going to wear your new ballet shoes, alright? Because I told you no. Yeah. Can you tell me my normal ballet shoes? But they have holes in them. Okay. Okay, if you want to wear those, you can wear those. Can I wear them to school? Yeah, but your normal ballet shoes, not your new ones, eh? Yes, I understand, Baba. Thanks, baby. are still playing I thought I'd quickly show you my outfit uh, it's just a little simple blue cami and then this skirt that I am so obsessed with um, from Mr. Price and it's lined what a bonus and then just these simple oh, excuse the plugs these simple shoes that I got from Mr. Price last summer super relaxed I was even too lazy to put on a strapless bra because I am not a fan of strapless bras um, but yeah that's my outfit for the day and we're about to jump in the car to go to school. Okay, just dropped Ari off at school. So now I need to um, go pick up some stuff for Maya from the PR company. Um, they literally live, they live. <laughs> the offices are literally around the corner from where I live. So I just said to them, don't bother couriering it. I will just come pop by and fetch it. So I'm just going to go do that quickly and then I need to go get um, a gift engraved. I'm going to go do that and while that's happening I need to pop into Discam and maybe even get another coffee um, and then home. And I'm really hoping that um, I can keep Maya awake until we get home because then she'll have a nap when we're home and I can get some work in while she sleeps but I think she might be asleep already. I'm gonna wake up in a few minutes. Sorry, girl. Anyway, yeah, so I'm just rushing, I'm not rushing, I'm walking to the PR company. And I'll see you guys later. And they're gone, just like that. Um, I'm home now. My dogs are going crazy. I don't understand these dogs. They are never quiet, ever. So I hope you can hear me. Um, I'm hoping Maya's going to go to sleep. She does seem quite sleepy. Dogs, it's enough. Um, and I've just put on some eggs to boil, some toast, and I'm just quickly doing some emails while I wait for that to happen. And yeah, hopefully Maya has a nice little sleep so that I can um, knock out some work. Fingers crossed. Okay, I think Maya's asleep. 
Um, it took a little bit of convincing, but it was a tired cry. So she had to cry a little bit, and I was like, put her dummy back in, and I think she's going to pass out. I can hear her moaning, like just talking to herself a little bit, but I reckon she's going to fall asleep like in the next minute. She is very tired. She slept for like 10 minutes in the car. So it's every time I put her to sleep. I have made my breakfast, which is over here, and some water because I have such a headache. Um, so I'm going to eat my breakfast at quarter to ten and um, do some work while I eat because I constantly multitask. <laughs> yeah, so it's work time for me until Maya wakes up. She travels all over her cot. Sometimes I find her at the bottom over here. Maya? How is your sleep? Okay. Playtime. Playtime and food time. Yeah. Um, it's like what, 20 past 11, so I had a really decent nap. I'm going to plonk her in her high chair. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. Mm -hmm. Maya, there we go. Ooh, there we go. Okay. Um, and sort out some lunch for her. She usually eats, eats lunch at about <laughs> 11. So, um, yeah, let's get some lunch ready for her. Hey. Do you want lunch? Please. You want some food? Look at these curls, Maya. Look at these crazy curls. Um, I'm going to give her some finger food lunch, I think. And while she does eat, I am going to wash the dishes because I didn't get around to doing them last night. This hair is unreal. <laughs> questions about about um, Maya and her eating and I did um, I did write a whole blog post about it which I'll link in the description bar but obviously things have changed since then um, and she's eating a lot more finger food so you would have seen for breakfast it was all finger foods now I was washing the dishes she ate a little bit of lunch as a finger food it was just dried apple um, but I do still like to give her, like, like to traditional feed her as well, just so I know that she's actually getting in because I never actually know how much she's eating and how much she's giving to Moose and Malva because she does love to feed the dogs. <laughs> and then, yeah, then I can control, like, that she actually gets some veggies in, that she actually gets some protein in, some fats and whatnot. So she literally has, breakfast is generally a finger food because it's just easier. So it'll be what we had today, like toast, or I'll do like little muffins that I've pre-made, or, I mean, yeah, you've seen me do it if you follow me on Instagram stories, uh, protein pancakes, omelette that I just cut up, and it is really important for kids to learn how to self-feed, um, and I've sort of been doing it with Maya for, I'd say, last, since she was about six months, so the last two months. All of her snacks are finger foods as well, and then... She basically has two lunches, so she has like a finger food lunch, and then I'll feed her as well. And then dinner, um, we, she sort of starts to get hungry before dinner is ready. So then we'll give her sort of like a snack, um, which is again a finger food, and then um, we'll... Oh, sorry. 
and then we'll feed her as well and I don't make up special purees or anything like that for her anymore literally whatever we are having whatever we've made having whether it's roast chicken whether it's curry whether it like, doesn't matter what it is um, we'll smush it up a little bit for her and that's what she eats so things have definitely gotten easier although a lot messier <laughs> but I mean she enjoys it and it is important for them sensory wise um, and just you know to learn how to actually start to feed themselves and another thing that I've, that I've done it since she was sort of on solids um, is once I'm finished feeding her this I'll give her the spoon with a little bit of food still on it and she started to navigate to put the spoon into her mouth I mean she's nowhere near ready to do the whole action of scooping up a food and putting it in her mouth but um, you know it's good to practice so yeah that's that's our we are on our feeding journey Ugh. Okay, so I'm on a mission to clean our playmates. So we've got this grey one and we've got a pink one. I'll link them in the description. But just from everyone running inside and outside, they've gotten a little bit like dusty and a little bit muddy. So I'm going to try to see if I can just mop it. Mop that side and then a little bit later when it's dry, turn it over again. Um, hopefully it works. I don't need to be sparkling clean, but just cleaner. So let's see if it works. <music> starts making these noises Those little, like that. that then I know she's tired are you tired Bubby is it time for her to do this again yeah she has been up for like an hour and a half usually she stretches like two hours sometimes three hours between naps yeah it's definitely time for a sleep oh here comes Malva okay let's go put her to bed the bitty buzz time, my puppy. Um, she still has a lunchtime bottle. It's like an hour after lunchtime for her afternoon nap. Night, night, my baby. Night, night. Night, night. I'm just making a whole bunch of macaroni because I'm just gonna make macaroni and cheese tonight for dinner. And I'll have some of the pasta for my lunch as well. So I'm just putting this on to boil. And while this boils, oh, I'm, put some olive oil in. Um, I'm going to go and do the rest of the play mats. But yeah, sorting out my lunch while Maya's asleep. So I just um, I made up the whole macaroni and cheese. Um, so later on, all I have to do is put it in the oven, which is just so great. Um, and I've eaten my lunch, and I'm not going to lie. Normally, if Maya is still sleeping, I try to have like an hour's snooze because um, I'm usually pretty like um, at this point in the day. Um, and normally, I'd also be having a cup of coffee now, but I've had this splitting headache all day. I've taken two still pains, so I don't think I can take anything more for a little while. Um, so it's just water, although I would kill for a cup of coffee. Um, yeah, she's still sleeping, she'll probably still sleep for like another hour, maybe two. Um, so I'm just going to. Yeah, I'm on my bed. I'm going to watch some TV while I work, 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 work. So hopefully I won't have to do too much tonight, although I do have like quite a whack to get through. Um, so yeah, time to keep on hustling, 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 hustling. <laughs> Just picked up a 
Harry from school. Oh, it is Binky. Say bye, Harry, Binky. Bye, Binky. No, no. I just picked Harry up from school, and um, I picked up the engraving just before that. But now we are going to go to the nursery because I want to buy some lavender. The um, man that helps us. Yeah, we'll go in the jungle just maybe. Um, the man that helps us in the garden is coming tomorrow and I want him to plant some lavender bushes for me in the back garden. Um, and there's a jungle gym, so obviously we shall have a little play over there. Um, there's two nurseries in this area and I'm actually just deciding which one to go to. Of course, we have to play first. So I'm showing the girls have a little play. And then we'll look for some plants. What, baby? Must I help you get onto it? Here you go. Wait. It wasn't that bad. What's my my doing? Oh, you found a spade? Ari, get that back to her, please. She was playing with that one. Aria? Yeah, no, go fetch your own bucket. Get that one back to Maya, please. Thank you. I don't know if she wants to make a sandcastle, but you can make your own. Oh, that's kind. Five o'clock. It's when everyone starts getting a bit tense. Um, I've just put the macaroni and cheese in the oven. Maya is getting hungry. Um, but it's only 15 minutes. Dan's quickly is taking in the washing for me with Aria. Because um, I think it might rain. I really hope it rains. But yeah. <laughs> October, so we're gonna catch October, okay? September, October, November, 
December. Yay! And what day are we today? <clears throat> Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yay! That was easy for me. Yeah, it is, hey. <laughs> Which day is first? Which day is first, Ari? I don't know. Maybe first day. Oh. First day, Friday. No. Maybe Wednesday. No. Maybe Sunday. No. What? Sunday. Yes. yes. Sunday, <laughs> Monday, Tuesday, What day is it today? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yay. What day is it for me? I mean, Tuesday. Come and see. One. No, say the days of the week and see. What comes after Tuesday? Uh, Monday. No, that's before Tuesday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Wednesday. Go. So tomorrow we'll catch Wednesday, hey? Yes. at night um, and Maya's just finished in the bath so I've changed her and um, I'm just busy making her bottle Ara generally stays in a little bit longer Dan um, lets her play and whatnot and then he will take her out get her dressed read her a story and then they are asleep so it's like six o'clock now the girl should be asleep by 6 30 latest so it's like an hour, maybe an hour and a half of absolute like crazy, but then they're asleep early and we're the rest of the night to ourselves. Okay, it's like nine o'clock and um, my work is done. Uh, the girl's obviously sleeping long ago. Um, I've had a bath. Okay, I still gotta take my mascara off, but I wash the rest of my face. Just gotta take my mascara off. And um, yeah, I've just made some coffee for Dan, some tea for myself. I'm trying to have green tea as much as I can. So I made some tea for myself. But yeah, guys, that's a day, a typical day for me. Um, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Let me know in the comments. Um, let me know if there's something else you'd like me to vlog, what else you'd like to see. Um, hit subscribe if you haven't already. And um, yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. Bye.